Okay, everybody. Hello, a very good evening and welcome to stream number 119, guys. Like, we are whizzing through the 100s here. Welcome to stream number 119. Welcome to Tower Simulator 3. Welcome to LPPT, uh, which is Lisbon in Portugal. Now, this was the stream uh, I was going to do on uh, Friday of last week, but... Um, well, as you know, if you watched uh, some of last week's streams, I was a little bit sniffly Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, and yeah, it kind of got a bit too much for me. I was like, you know what, I'm having the rest of the week off to recover. Um, so we didn't get to do LPPT last week, but here you are tonight uh, for a little bit of action here in Portugal. So uh, the last time we streamed uh, this was in stream number 87. Um, so a little while ago, it was on the 5th of April 2024, just looking at my notes here. And we've only ever streamed this two times in the past. So this is time number three. Uh, and three is my lucky number, guys. One week from today, 3rd of September, I will be da 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 da. Years old, um, so yeah, it's gonna be my birthday one week today. Starting to get a little bit hyped, anyway. Enough about me. Uh, here we go. So, um, it's uh, relatively quiet airport to some extent, uh, only one runway. We're going to be uh, departing off runway 20. Where are we? No, we're not. We're going to be departing off runway 02, 02. and we're also going to be taking off. Uh, uh, landing on runway 02 as well. So all departures, all landings on runway 02. Uh, so we'll, yeah, we'll definitely be making use of uniform one, uniform two, uniform, you know, the, the whole sort of uniform taxiway. Uh, and hopefully they'll come off around, well, I'd rather they come off at uniform five, to be honest. Um, so I might uh, make sure I say that as they uh, land so it should be uh, fairly interesting, to be honest. We're doing 6 a.m., so the clouds are still a little bit pink. The sun is uh, still rising. Look at the uh, bridge over there. It's so freaking cool. Like, this must be one of the biggest bridges in the world. Like, it literally goes across an entire ocean into the distance. Very, very, very cool indeed. Uh, here's the runway here. It's actually quite a decent-sized runway, and we've got a ton of... An absolute ton of planes and I really love that I can go down right to ground level uh, in this airport. I'm just going to press play real quick so we can have a quick look at some of these planes. As you can expect there are a lot of Air Portugal planes which is you know great because that is where we are. Uh, a smattering of other planes. We've got an, a random Iberia but check it out guys. Check it out. This is what makes me excited for Lisbon. We do have some easy jet planes here. Let's go. Lisbon if you hadn't one. had enough of easy jet yesterday in London Gatwick, well, we've got some more today. Not as many though. And check it out, guys. Even better. Ryanair. <laughs> Ryanair. One, two, three, four Ryanair. Look at this one. Like the sun is literally lighting it up, which is kind of weird because. You know, there should be a shadow on this side. The sun is not facing this side. It's behind the wing, so I don't know how it's lit up. That's a little bit strange. Anyway, more easy jets. Another uh, Air Portugal or two. So, yeah, it should be a really uh, fun stream. I'm expecting it to be relatively uh, chill, to be honest, because it is a quieter airport. Look at this guy. That's the feeling when you visit Azores. Dot PT. What is PT? I, I kind of want to say Philippines, but I don't think it is. I think I'm very, very wrong on that. Look at this one. See, we're getting some of the uh, new liveries in here. Very, very nice. Like, I don't know what flag that is, but if someone knows, feel free to put it uh, in the chat because, you know, I'm all about learning new things here. <gasps> oh, we've got British Airways as well. Fantastic. All we need is a Jet 2 and this... Uh, this would be absolutely amazing. I think there's only one airport which has got all my all my favourite airlines in. I think that's Zurich. I can't remember off the top of my head which one it is. I'd need to check. Um, but anyway, uh, we have got our first pushback. I think we saw it earlier. Is it the Azores? No. Yeah? No? Yeah? Yeah, it is the Azores. It's this one here. So what's he called? Air Azores. Okay, perfect. I've got my little clicky thing. Got the overlays, but we don't need the overlays right now while it's quiet. 
Erezor is 1, 2, 1. Pushback approved. Expect runway 0, 2. So this airport has a clockwise flow, which is nice. I actually prefer anti-clockwise, uh, but there we go. That's just me. And I just love that I can go right down to ground level. Like, you can just get so up close and personal with these planes. It just makes me so much happier than sort of being, you know, sort of over here. You know, where it doesn't feel very personal. <laughs> oh, right through. There we go. Let's zoom out a little bit there as well. So a slight amount of cloud cover in Lisbon today. We are using METAR Live. Uh, this is the live weather at the point of recording this stream. I love live weather. I really do. It just makes it so much more interesting. Thank you, Mr. Tug. Quite a nice plane. Lots to look at. Oh, yeah, I do wonder what flag that is. Uh, let me know in the chat if you know. It's obviously a European country. I see the Euro flag. But what country is that, guys? What country? Someone tell me. I would Google it right now, but, you know, that would mean getting distracted. Uh, we've got a uh, plane that's just popped up. And the call sign of DTA. I wonder what that is. Uh, we'll find out shortly when he makes... Okay. Erezores one two one continue taxi. No, I didn't say contact departure. Negative. I'm on the ground. one two one. Here we go. Erezores one two one continue taxi. Continue Question is, taxi. which way is he going Aerosol's to go? One two one. Oh, okay, that's not bad. I can live with that. I can live with that. Yeah, 6.04 in game time. So I'm hoping we're going to get the morning rush here. Um, but we'll see. <laughs> At least you know I've got one plane coming in and one plane going out. Alpine. Right, well we'll let him go on his way. Seeing as we are getting uh, a couple of planes on the... On the go now, we'll get follow mode on, boom, and we're going to see the Alpine. That's easy jet, which we learnt in the last stream. Alpine 19 Victor Charlie, pushback approved, expect runway 02. Pushback approved, expect runway 02. Right, that plane Alpine I was telling you about, Victor GTA, Charlie. he should be making contact literally any second now. So I'm just going to stay here for a moment so I can listen out for him. Any moment now, come on. Don't let me down. Tower, DTA ah, he's actually called DTA. Interesting. I wonder what airline that is then. DTA 650 heavy, runway 02, clear to land. Okay, so we'll pop back to him in a runway well, two, later. Clear to land. DTA 650 heavy. And the Azores is all ready. Ready to go. We're just coming up to um, the... Um, holding point now. Let me just check my um, views here. So F8 I've got there for landings. F9 is where landings come off. F10 is that side of the terminal. F11 is the other side of the terminal. Okay, so that's pretty decent. I can live with that for sure. Arizora is 121. Runway 02 line up and wait. Runway zero to line up and wait. Air one right, we'll one. go it back into manual for the time being. I'll well, just wait for a couple of things to kick off. What a beauty. Lisbon ground. Alpine one nine or Victor Charlie ready to taxi. Ready to taxi, eh? Well, I'll be with you in a minute. I want to get this guy in the air before my first landing appears. Listen to the roar of that engine. Sounds like a good roar to me, guys. Oh, yeah. Let's go. There's always 121. Runway 02, cleared for takeoff. 
a shame, really, that the sound cuts out. When you give that takeoff command, the sound isn't continuous. It sort of almost restarts. It almost restarts. Um, it's kind of strange, but there we go. He's off. And we'll get into follow mode as well as he gets underway. Our first takeoff of the stream. Our first takeoff in Lisbon since April. April of this year. Right, let's follow him. Boom. Very, very nice. So let's see if this still works. Errors always 121. Contact Lisbon departure on 118.95. Lisbon departure on 118.95. Lisbon departure on 118.95. Errors always 121. Good morning. Good. It's working nicely. Air Portugal 1544, runway 02, clear to land. Runway 02, clear to land. Air Portugal 1544. Nice, really nice scenery, actually. Don't you agree, guys? Right if you agree in the chat. Really, really beautiful scenery here. Sort of heading off towards the mountains. It's beautiful. Right, let's get the uh, easy jet going. Alpine 19 Victor Charlie, runway 02, continue taxi. Runway 02, continue taxi. Alpine 1-9 or Victor Charlie. Thank you very much. That DTA plane is on his way in. I want to watch the whole cinematic here. Uh, so he's just under three miles out. But yeah, let's watch the whole cinematic. Coming in over Lisbon should be pretty cool, to be honest. And I'm very curious what sort of plane this is. Another Air Portugal will be making contact any moment now as well. Lisbon Tower, Air Portugal 9 or 6 Alpha Whiskey on final go. zero 02. You can see the next plane in the distance as well. Air Portugal 9 is 6 Alpha Whiskey, runway zero 02, clear to land. I've got uh, plane runway separation on uh, 3 Air nautical Portugal, miles, which is the whiskey. shortest I'm allowed, because you know, I obviously want as much traffic as possible in this hour, running it at 100% uh, density as always as well. I always quite like seeing the planes in the background, especially when it's nighttime, guys, and you can sort of see those blinking lights. It's, it's, it's so pretty. Anyway, DTA650, what sort of plane are you, bro? What sort of plane are you? We're about to find out. Oh, it's red. But I can't read that. Oh, I might have to get a close-up of that when it lands. Quite a nice looking plane though. Uh, red, contrasted with white and yellow. We'll get a close-up of him in a bit. We've got a few landings. Um, what did I say I wanted him to come off at? Is it Alpha? Five. Let's just see which which one he comes off at. Um, I'm very very curious here. So this is Alpha Five that he's coming up to now. Um, yeah, yeah. Looks like he's coming off at Alpha Five. Good, 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 good. That will do perfectly. DTA 650, taxi to ramp. Nice and easy, that one. Except he didn't hear me at all. So we'll try that again. Oh, wait, maybe he did hear me. He seems to be going. No, he didn't. <laughs> DTA 650, heavy, taxi to ramp. Off you go, bro. Right, taxi to ramp. next one. DTA 650, heavy. Right, so this is an Air Portugal. Air Portugal 258, runway 02, clear to land. Runway 02, clear We've got to three land. planes uh, coming in, one behind uh, each other. And all uh, three miles apart from each other as well. I'm just trying to work out in my head where do I want to get this um, easy jet to slot in? Possibly after the next one. Uh, there's just a slightly bit more of a gap. Anyway, here we go. Air Portugal. 
and landing straight away. There's the easy jet there. I'm just not comfortable with the three miles separation. Um, while we're waiting, let's just get a close up on this dude here. Oh, Angola! Bloody hell. Angola Airlines. Damn, guys. What a nice plane. I like it. Angola Airlines. And look at that on the back as well. It's some sort of... I don't know what animal that is, but <laughs> it's cool. It's cool. Okay. The Air Portugal has landed. There's another one coming in in a sec. Uh, let's just see where does he want to go. He's got a nice straightforward taxi to ramp by the looks of things. Um, alpha 2, Alpha 3, Alpha 4, Alpha 5. Yeah, that's fine. Air Portugal 1544, taxi to ramp. Taxi to ramp. Air Portugal 1544. Thank you very much indeed. So there's another one coming in, and then we can get the easy jet going. Alpine 19 at Victor Charlie. Line up and wait behind next landing aircraft. No, nope, that didn't work. I don't think that command works anymore, you know. I'll try a different, different version of it. Alpine 19 at Victor Charlie, runway 02, line up and wait behind next landing aircraft. Yeah, that command doesn't seem to work anymore. I noticed this on a stream uh, the other day. I might have to have a look in the uh, commands spreadsheet just to check if it's been reworded or something. The idea is as soon as this guy lands, um, the plane that's waiting will immediately sort of line up and wait. But we can just give it to him manually. It's no big deal at all. I just want to sort of get him off straight away, but I might just give him the immediate takeoff command. We'll see. Let's get him going. Alpine 19 at Victor Charlie, runway 02, line up and wait. Runway 02, line up and wait. Alpine 19 or Victor Charlie. The DTA is already finished, so let's get rid of him off the strip. Next plane uh, is three miles away, so it's going to be quite close, really. This is the issue when you've only got one runway, isn't it? You end up even though it's like a quiet airport or whatever, you end up thinking like quite logistically and you know, it's still it's still as challenging because of that logistical thinking. Right. Uh, you need to go to Alpha 1, that's fine. So he should come off here. You should be ready. Yep. Alpine 19 and Victor Charlie, runway 02, cleared for takeoff. Takeoff number two. Runway 02, cleared for and this should lead straight Alpine, into uh, the Air Portugal landing, the next Air Portugal landing, and there's one that's going to make contact any moment now as well. Lisbon Tower, Air Portugal 1937 on final 02. Air Portugal 1937, runway 02, clear to land. Runway 02, clear to land. Portugal, the next plane is nearly here actually, it's going to be very very close indeed. Luckily 3 nautical miles is just enough to get a takeoff done, just enough. Alpine 19 at Victor Charlie, contact Lisbon departure on 118 decimal 905. Lisbon departure on 118.905, Alpine 19 Victor Charlie. Alright, we're going to go straight to that landing. Here he is. Just in time, actually. No outgoing planes at this moment in time, so it's just incoming planes. Love the short landing. It's much better, isn't it, when they just land straight away as opposed to waiting 30 seconds or whatever. You can see the easy jet there in the distance. Pretty cool. Uh, let's get uh, this one moving over here. Let's get him out of the way. Air Portugal 96 Alpha Whiskey, taxi to ramp. Taxi to ramp. Air Portugal 9 or 6 Thank Alpha Whiskey. Thank you very whiskey. much indeed. So you've landed. I'm going to stick with him for a moment. So we've got uh, three Air Portugals on the ground, all taxiing to ramp. We'll get some close ups of them in uh, just a moment or two. So there's no outgoing planes at this present moment in time. It's all incoming planes, isn't it? It's like the opposite of what I'd expect at 6 a.m. in the morning. You'd think the stands would be uh, hurrying their planes out. 
Anyway. He's coming up to the uh, holding point. Air Portugal 258, taxi to ramp. And the taxi to ramps are nice and straightforward as well, which taxi I really do ramp. like. Right, um, let's get ourselves into a manual mode. So this is the... This is our first Air Portugal. He's nearly finished his uh, adventure, his journey to his stand. So he's nearly done. Graphics on this airport are superb. They really are superb. Air Portugal. Uh, then if we go down, this is uh, Alpha. If we go further down Alpha, much further down Alpha, you can see our second Air Portugal. We'll get a head-on close-up this time. Uh, it may glitch us through the aircraft, so <laughs> be aware that that might happen. It sometimes does it, sometimes doesn't. <laughs> there you go. You got a front seat, literally. That's quite cool. It's weird, but it's cool. And this is the one that just landed a minute ago. We'll get a side profile of this one, I think. Beautiful planes, aren't they, guys? Tap. I wonder why they're called Tap, like on the side. Bytap.com. I wonder, like, what the significance of that is. I wonder. Right, well, we've got our next landing coming up soon, uh, so that's good. We'll hop over. We'll tap over to that landing. It's another tap in uh, just a few moments. You can see the Angola Express there in the background. British Airways EasyJet. Three very, very, very nice, nice planes. I love it when we can just spend time and do this, guys. You know, just spend time with the planes. <laughs> I mean, that's why we're here, right? That's why we're here. Right, um, we have a landing. Let's let's go into follow mode. Let's see that landing. And when he lands, I think I'm going to have him hold just so we've got planes to watch. Because uh, there's nothing coming in on the radar. Which means uh, we do run the risk of uh, twiddling our, thing our fingers in the uh, very near future. There he is. Air Portugal. What a beautiful day. I've never been to Portugal, you know. I think I'd quite like to visit it one time. But getting me out of the country is incredibly difficult. Right, we'll be knocking on 20 years soon. Ryanair 385 with information Saved by Ryanair. Requesting push and start. Saved by Ryanair. Let's go. Ryanair, you are my saviour. And one of my favourite airlines. Ryanair 385, pushback approved. Expect runway 02. The only problem is, guys, if I go into manual mode, Ryanair the only problem is, right, hold on, let me find him. He's over here somewhere. There he is. The only problem is, he is literally super close to the runway, which means we're only going to see him for about two minutes. <laughs> But there he is, Ryanair, Ryanair.com, um, the UK's number one no-frills airline. And it is as no-frills as it gets, guys. But you know what? I don't mind. Like, at the end of the day, a seat is a seat, a plane is a plane. I don't care about first-class treatment for thousands of pounds. I just want a plane to get me from A to B for the cheapest price possible. Sometimes I will pay for extra legroom, actually, more so as I've grown older and medical conditions have materialized, but um, that's usually all I will go for. Look at this building here. The radar tower. That's pretty cool. Never noticed it before. Nav Portugal. Isn't that cool? Write in the chat if you think it's cool. Give me a hype. If you're a YouTube member of this channel, give me a hype. And if you're not a YouTube member, become one right now, or else. Look at this dude. I love these planes. 
But I guess, like, everyone loves the planes from their country, right? Right? If you're not a UK person in this chat, you probably don't care less about this plane. It means nothing to you. Right, Mr. Tug. Are you happy? Lisbon ground. Ryan yes, you are. Ready to taxi. All right. Ryan Air 385, continue taxi. We're going to follow him to the runway because why not? <laughs> We're only going to be with him Ryan for a couple of moments. Well, minutes. He's literally, he's literally going to go down here, round this corner here, and he's going to go follow this yellow line here, and then he's at the runway. Like, literally. We can see him. We can see him from the runway. Look. There he is. So, he's, you know, we need to spend as much time with him as possible, right? <laughs> right. Not quite a uh, straight into angle, but a nice angle all the same. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Alright, let's get him going around this corner. Let's do it from the other angle. Let's go over the other side. Uh, we've got a postman just popped up on the radar. If memory serves, I think postman is DHL. I can't remember. It's one of the cargo planes. I'm sure of it. I'm sure of it. He's just spinning around all over the place, this plane, isn't he, as he turns around and stuff. I'm sure postman is DHL, but I'm probably very, very wrong. Call sign is SWT. I don't recognize that call sign, but I do recognize um, sort of the, the tag postman. See the green light there? Starboard light. As he makes his way around to the holding point, which is, uh, well, just there. I think we can get rid of him straight away as well, actually. Oh, you're not waiting. Oh, you're going to stay with the holding point. That's fine. That's fine. Sorry, mate. Sorry, I didn't mean to judge you. Okay. Ryanair 385, runway 02, line up and wait. Not often we follow the entire journey of a plane in this game. <laughs> it's quite rare. Uh, it's nice to do, isn't it? Just to sort of see everything from start to end. Lisbon ground radio check. How do you read? You'll notice, guys, I've deliberately left the Air Portugal that landed a while ago. I've deliberately left him there because, you know, it's always good to have a plane. A backup plane to watch when you run out of planes, which we are going to do in a minute Also, Are you ready, Mr. Ryan? I'm going to go to this side because I prefer, I prefer this side. Yeah, since that sound. Okay, hear what I mean by the continuous sound. It'll like cut out now and then it'll come back into play. Ryan right, no, 385, runway 02, clear for takeoff. Runway 02, clear for takeoff. Ryan yeah, 385. I mean, like the sound changes completely, then it sort of restarts. Anyway, let's get the show on the road. We'll got fuller mode on for in a minute as well. I quite like doing runway cinematics of my own like this, you know? It's just cool. Yeah, yeah, Mr. Postman, I'll be with you soon. Bear with me. Shall we follow him? Let's follow him. Ryanair 385, contact Lisbon departure on 118 decimal 905. Lisbon departure on 118.9 or 5. Let's talk Ryan to Air that 385. Postman. Good morning. Postman 8325, runway 02, clear to land. Runway 02, clear to land. So here's the state of play. So there's a postman with clearance. And then the tap. The Air Portugal, who's been waiting very patiently. Air Portugal 19037, taxi to ramp. So we're going to come in back taxi into to manual ramp. to watch Air him. Because he is the only active plane right now uh, until the uh, next one comes in. Air Portugal coming across the tower. Quite a nice shot there, actually. Just crossing the tower there in the distance. 
There is one airport I've actually been meaning to do for a while, guys, and that is, um, what's it called? St. David's in Bermuda. It's actually the one airport I've not been to for the longest period of time at this present moment in time looking at my spreadsheet here. Uh, the last time we went to Bermuda was on the 6th of October last year, 2023. It's been, well, we're knocking on 11 months since we've last been there. Um, it's, it's a very quiet airport, so I'm kind of keeping that one in my back pocket right now uh, for when I want to do just a super chill stream. A bit like this, actually, but it's even quieter uh, than Lisbon. But St. David's Bermuda is on my list of airports that, I, that will be done at some point. Uh, in the near future. Hopefully we don't get to the one year mark. That would just be embarrassing. Um, but yeah. And he's actually closely followed by a very old friend of ours. And that's St. Thomas's. The first ever airport to be released. We haven't done that since Halloween. 31st October of last year. Again, because it's, you know, it's a very small. It's an easy peasy airport. And I, you know, I like the challenge. Uh, but it is nice to revisit and we will be revisiting it uh, especially when the new graphics update comes out every airport will uh, be revisited um, as, as we go through the playlist as it were the rotation obviously there are some airports I play more than others because they're more popular and you know I'm not just going to play airports that aren't as popular all the time because that would be stupid and not smart um, but there we go. Right, that postman plane is nearly um, with us. This Air Portugal here is going to turn left here and then left again. Interesting that this one's... Ah, I was just going to say, interesting that he's ready to go because he hasn't popped up, but he's just popping up now. Uh, so that's nice. We'll watch, the, uh, we'll watch this one park. Um, we'll come back to that EasyJet in a little while, so I want to see this um, postman come in, to be honest. I'm pretty sure it is a DHL, but we will see now, and I will probably be proved wrong. Right, are you ready? Are you ready? Let's do this. Let's go into manual mode. Uh, not manual mode, follow mode. Is it a DHL? Yes or no? I don't think it is. It, I know it's quite far away, but the sort of immediate coloration tells me it isn't. I'm just going to watch and wait here. Well, it's definitely a jet. I did wonder for a second if it was a turboprop, but it's not. It's definitely a jet. It's got a yellow fin. Oh! Oh, it is DHL! I'm right! It is DHL, operated by Swift Air. Okay, I feel much better about myself now. I'm not as stupid as I thought I was. <laughs> I actually got that one right. Okay, so it is DHL. That's, I was just wondering, really, because the, the, the call sign SWT, so that obviously sounds for Swift Air, and it's being operated by DHL. Uh, so that makes sense. Okay, I'm quite happy about that. Let's do... Let's just show you guys that, because there's not much happening at all. Let's just move him into the landed category. And here's the EasyJet. Alpine 70 Bravo Delta. Pushback approved. Expect runway 02. I just had another one pop up there, did you see? A little sneaky Pushback one. Pushback approved, expect runway 02. So you're Alpine on Alpha, seven, zero, that might Bravo be an Delta. issue, but we'll cross that if we need to. Alpine 71 Romeo Delta, pushback approved, expect runway 02. Pushback approved, expect runway 02. Alpine 71 Romeo Delta. Okay, we've got an Air Portugal that's going to make contact with us in a moment. Um, so I'm going to keep my ears open for that. Lisbon ground, Alpine 71 oh. Romeo Delta with information hotel. Requesting push and start. It's not him. Lisbon Tower, Air Portugal 1484 on final 02. Air Portugal 1484, runway 02, clear to land. So he'll be with us in a little bit. Runway 02, clear to land. Right, bro, where do you need to go? You need to go by Bravo, but I was going to say something to ramp because there's nothing to impede his progress here. Postman 8325, taxi to ramp. Oh, 
probably get a close up of him as well, because, you know, why not? Where are you? There you are. I quite like my DHL planes, especially like when it's like this, when it's two planes in one. Swift Air and DHL all rolled into one, guys. Also, where have my pink clouds gone? It's like full on daylight now. We need to do another nighttime stream. We haven't done one for a while. We haven't done one for a while, guys. Let me check quickly. When was my last nighttime stream? My last Lisbon sunset Brown. stream was London Gatwick, Gatwick on stream 109. So that was 10 streams ago. Uh, my last nighttime stream was... It was Cattle. It was Jackson Atlanta in stream 106. Lisbon Brown. Oh, damn. Alpine 7 -1, Romeo Delta that was... Um, Quite a long time ago, stream 106. So we definitely do another nighttime stream at some point. At some point. Okay. Cool. Right, you're ready to go. Let's get follow mode back on. Uh, but let's do you first. Alpine 70 Bravo Delta, continue taxi. So again, it's a very short taxi. You'll be at the runway in a taxi. couple of moments. Alpine 70 Bravo Delta. Uh, you'll be in position two. Take him another minute or so. Alpine 71 Romeo Delta, continue taxi. That's you sorted. Continue taxi. Alpine 71 Romeo Delta. The uh, DHL is actually nearly home already, guys. Nearly home already. I wonder if there's any other uh, cargo Air plane Portugal found here. Let's have a look. This is where he's parking, but all I see is Air Portugal, so that's a bit strange. Usually, like the cargo planes, like they're usually grouped together, aren't they? Uh, but now he's going to park over here, uh, which is, you know, it's absolutely fine. Absolutely fine. Right. Uh, one Air Portugal coming in, but there's another one behind him. Air Portugal 1139 and runway 02 clear to land. Runway 02 clear to land. Air Portugal 1139. Right. Perfect. So we've got a couple of minutes before he gets here. Where are you pulling in? So right at the end. Nice. I'm glad we have DHL here. Easy jet. Taxiing down. We've got about two minutes. Taxi, I'd imagine, to the runway. The other easy jet is almost there already. Ooh, what's that green building I just saw in the background? Ah, some sort of stadium. That's pretty cool, guys. Look at that. Look at that. I wonder if that would actually make a good thumbnail. I did take some pictures as usual before like the stream started or whatever, but that might actually make a cool thumbnail. I don't know. Uh, I'll take a quick screenshot just in case I change my mind later on. So I'm very particular with my thumbnails. Alpine 70. Oh, actually no, I can't. I was gonna uh, tell him to take off, but the uh, Air Portugal is too close. Too close and we have to be safe on these uh, single runways, which means we're, but we're gonna have Bravo Delta and Romeo Delta, like he'll have caught up. So we'll have two planes to take off at once, but there's two planes landing as well. So it's gonna be like one lands, one takes off, one lands, one takes off, like that, I think. And there's the strip. Two in, two out, so that's what's happening here. Let's zoom in a little bit, you can see that second plane there. So it's gonna be quite tight. They're only three miles apart. So I'm gonna have to be really on the ball here and getting these planes off. Time we on. Wow, we're 40 minutes in already. Well, 39. That is crazy. Goes Lisbon to show, ground, Alpine, even when the airports are quiet, requesting push and it start. still goes fast. Because, uh, you, you know, when you're focusing on all your close-ups and things. Uh, this is Air Portugal 1484 coming into land. And we'll get uh, Bravo Delta in the air. Well, lined up straight away, I think. Beautiful. Alpine 70 Bravo Delta, runway 02, line up and wait. Runway zero and as he two, comes line up off the Alpine runway, zero, we should Bravo be able Delta. to get uh, Bravo Delta into the air. Got one plane that wants to push back as well. I might do that now. Alpine 7605, push back approved, expect runway 02. And just to show you guys where he is, he's just over here on Alpha, so. Potentially going to be in the way, but it'll be fine. It'll be fine. 
Nightmare, are you coming off? Uh, here would be fine. Just just here. Um, uh, alpha, alpha 6, please. Alpha 6. Okay, let's go. Alpine 70, Bravo Delta, runway 02, cleared for takeoff. Runway 02, cleared for takeoff. Alpine yeah, 70, Bravo the, uh, Delta. Yeah, just come off the runway there, so completely safe. All good. We are ready to rumble. And the next air Portugal is literally, literally almost here as well. Straight into another landing, straight into another takeoff. Good. Requesting push Next, I want to just uh, landed. Alpine 70 Bravo Delta, contact Lisbon departure on 118.95. Excellent. Lisbon departure on 118.95. 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 Lisbon Lisbon Tower, Air Portugal 07 Victor Romeo on final 02. Air Portugal 07 Victor Romeo, runway 02 clear to land. Alright, let's go. Runway get 02, cleared to land. Air Portugal 07 Victor Romeo. Sir. Alpine 71 Romeo Delta, runway 02, line up and wait. Alright. Runway 02, We've got one line up and wait. Back to do Alpine over here. 71 Romeo Delta. Air Portugal 428, pushback approved, expect runway 02. Thank you. Push back approved, expect back runway 02. As well, you should be in a moment. And where are you going? Oh, he's actually going in an interesting way. Um, I need him to hold short of, hold on. Um, probably Mike. Pull shot of echo. Pull shot of echo just to be safe. Where are you? Not you. You. Air Portugal 1484. Hold short of taxiway echo. Hold short of taxiway echo. Air Portugal 1484. This is why you should check every single landing because staying taxi to ramp when you don't know where they're going can be quite dangerous. Take off. Alpine 71 Romeo Delta, runway 02, clear for takeoff. Runway 02, cleared for takeoff. Alpine 71 Romeo Delta. Excellent. Let me just check that uh, airport that just landed as well before the next one comes in. Keeping my eye on that other air Portugal that we just told to hold short of Echo because he's going to be right there in just a moment's time. If he doesn't hold short, we are going to have a big problem. <laughs> There's the one that needs to taxi it's just over ground. here. Portugal, Come on, hold short. I'm watching the uh, map on my monitor and he, he doesn't. Oh, wait, wait, I think he is. Alpine 71 Romeo Delta contact Lisbon departure on 118 small 95. Lisbon departure on 118.95. Right, Alpine we need to go Romeo back Delta. over Good here. Morning. Is he holding short? He is holding short. That should be just enough space for the, um, not that one, the tap, the Air Portugal to move out. Let's just double check. Air Portugal 428, continue taxiing. So if we watch it from the perspective of continue this plane, actually, let's go into manual mode. Let's go into manual mode. Uh, where are you? There you are. It should be fine. I'm glad I did double check that. To be so he should turn to his left, which is our right. Good, good. You see what I mean? Even a quiet airport can have jigsaw puzzles like this to sort out. Airport called 1484, continue taxi. And then this one can move. Continue taxi. Airport called 1484. Perfect. Another dilemma solved. Let's get this guy moving. Where do you Lisbon need to be? Ground. This one's a straightforward one. Hotel, Kilo, with information, hotel. 
Requesting push and start. Air Portugal 1139, a taxi to ramp. That's a nice straightforward one. Taxi to ramp. Air Portugal 1139. Right, are you pushing back? Why aren't you pushing back? Alpine 7605, pushback approved, expect runway 02. I'm sure I gave him the command, but I obviously didn't. Pushback approved, expect runway 02. Alpine 7605. Ryanair 6 Hotel Kilo, pushback approved, expect runway 02. Pushback approved, expect runway 02. Actually, a little Ryanair bit busy at the Hotel moment. Team. Well, busy for this airport. <laughs> Air Portugal 10907, runway 02, clear to land. Runway 02, clear to land. Air beautiful. Portugal 10907. Beautiful, beautiful. Right, so this Air Portugal is ready to go, uh, but we're going to wait because uh, this one is uh, pretty close, to be honest. I can see 1484 has finished, so I'll get rid of him off the strip. Lovely. Give me a hype in the chat if you're enjoying the stream, guys. It is nice doing all these close ups and things, I love it. <laughs> the next plane's just appeared as well in the sky, very nice. Uh, this is Air Portugal uh, 07 Victor Romeo coming in. There's our next takeoff there. Air Portugal 428, runway 02, line up and wait. Runway 02, line up and wait. Air Portugal 428. Yes, sir. Alright, while he's doing what he's doing, let's just check on our pushback. So we've got an easy jet on the north side. on. Alpha. Alpine oh. 7605 ready oh, wow. to taxi. Nice timing. Alpine 7605 continue taxi. That was nice timing. Continue taxi. Alpine 7605. Good, because uh, this Air Portugal would have caught up with him. Uh, so that's actually worked out quite nicely. Uh, the other pushback is here. It's the Ryanair. He should be ready at uh, any moment as well, actually. Any moment. Just waiting for this guy to come off the runway. Ryanair 6 Hotel there we go, there's Ryanair taxi. ready. Off the runway, please, please, please. Thank you. Air Portugal 428, and runway 02, cleared for takeoff. Runway 02, cleared for takeoff. Air Portugal 428. It's all going well, nice clockwise flow. Beautiful. <laughs> all looking good. Next plane um, will be landing as well in just a few moments time, probably in about a minute, minute and a half away. You can see the Air Portugal just landed just over here, we'll just keep him there for a moment. Air Portugal 428, contact Lisbon departure on 118.95. Lisbon departure on 118. Point nine five. Air Portugal four two eight. Good morning. Good morning. Have a safe flight. Okay, let's just get this guy moving. Air Portugal zero seven Victor Romeo taxi to ramp. Nice straightforward one that one. Very very taxi easy to, to do. Air Portugal uh, Ryanair zero seven Victor Romeo. Well. Ryanair six Hotel Kilo continue taxi. And he's actually going to be number one. So let's just do all those planes Ryanair, going around. With the uh, easy jet in position two. Meanwhile, an Air Portugal coming into land. Lisbon ground. Um, Air Portugal one nine or two zero with information hotel. Another push back just push popped up. Start. Another Air Portugal just popped up as well. We've got both landing and takeoff. So that's good. Eleven thirty nine has just parked. Let's get rid of him off the strip. And this is uh, Air Portugal one zero nine seven. You know, I could never get bored of watching these landings ever. They're so cool. So freaking cool. Welcome to Lisbon, sir. Welcome, welcome. Right, so the Ryanair and the uh, EasyJet, they're right next to each other. Literally right next to each other, so we're going to have two takeoffs back to back uh, in the very, very near future. Should get them all, both of these done before the next landing, for sure. I'll push back over here, but do I want to wait? Yeah, I'm gonna wait. Uh, this Air Portugal here literally wants to park 
in the next slot above where he is, just here where my mouse is moving. He wants to park there, so it's just smart to let him catch up and park instead of holding up the flow, which we definitely don't want. We're not going to penalize for waiting just for a minute here. Let's get the Ryanair ready. Ryanair 6 Hotel Kilo, runway 02, line up and wait. Runway 02, line up and wait. Ryanair 6 Hotel Kilo. Excellent. Right, um, you've landed now. Where do you want to go? Interesting. I'd rather he goes by Alpha, to be honest. Just to help the flow. Um, Air Portugal 109 at 7, taxi to ramp via Alpha 2. Yeah, taxi that's to ramp via Alpha 2. That's Air Portugal 109 at 7. Actually, should I get him going via Quebec 2? Because if the other guy's going to push back, yeah. Air Portugal 109 is 7, taxi to ramp via Quebec 2. Taxi yeah. to ramp via Quebec 2. Airport Portugal 109 There you go. So this guy is pretty much ready to go. You can see the Air Portugal on the left there flashing away. He's ready to push back. We just need to wait for him to pass. Air Portugal 19 2 0. Push back approved. Expect runway 0 2. I think that'll do, guys. Pushback approved. Expect runway zero two. Air Portugal one nine or two zero. Uh, not you. Lisbon Tower. You. Air Portugal one four nine or eight on final zero two. Air Portugal one four nine or eight. Runway zero two. Clear to land. Runway zero two. Clear to land. Air Portugal one four nine or eight. Ryanair six Hotel Kilo. Runway zero two. Clear for takeoff. Runway zero two. Clear for takeoff. Right. We have got time to get rid of the uh, easy jet as well, so I'm going to get him lined up. Alpine 7605, runway 02, line up and wait. And this is the first time in the screen we've had line up and wait. a queue Alpine of one. <laughs> a queue of one. Ryanair taking off. Ryanair 6 Hotel Kilo, contact Lisbon departure on 118 decimal 905. Lisbon departure on 118.905, Ryanair 6 Hotel Kilo, good morning. Good morning, so this one should be ready now. Alpine 7605, runway 02, quick for takeoff. Nice timing, very nice runway timing zero indeed. Two. Clear for takeoff. Alpine 7605. Um, well, he's just getting Lisbon going. Ground. Let's get this guy moving. Air Portugal 1920, ready to taxi. Air Portugal 19020, continue taxi. It's got an interesting taxi route, actually, continue but taxi. it's fine. There's Air nothing Portugal to impede his progress whatsoever. The uh, strip is getting pretty... Uh, Pretty quiet again. Well, that's fine. We're coming up to the one hour mark anyway. Alpine 7605, contact Lisbon departure on 118.905. Lisbon departure on 118.905. Lisbon departure on 118.905. Lisbon departure on 118.905. Alpine 7605. Good morning. Good morning. Right, guys. Have a look at the uh, overlays. <laughs> it's so dead. Uh, we've got one plane. Uh, so blue is outgoing plane. Uh, one outgoing plane. It's uh, it's an Air Portugal. Surprise, surprise. Uh, he's got about a minute, a minute or so, uh, to get to the uh, runway. And then we also have one plane coming in. Uh, it's another Air Portugal. Um, and he's he's three miles out, so probably about a minute and a half or so. So I'm thinking I'm thinking uh, do this landing and then do this takeoff and then that that might be that uh, the hour goes by really fast it really does especially when they're taxiing at speed like this dude bloody hell he's really going for it isn't he? <laughs> he can't wait to get onto that runway
It's been a fun stream. I've enjoyed it. It's just nice to chill. Especially on a Tuesday when I don't normally stream on a Tuesday. So this is like an extra bonus stream. Right, guys? Right, guys? Makes you want to click that join button, doesn't it? Yeah, I thought it did. Yeah, he will be ready to go straight away. And if we turn around here and look to the right, there's the plane that is landing. So let's get follow mode on. Uh, click, 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 follow. So last landing, last takeoff, end of the stream. Coming up. It's actually worked out quite nicely, to be honest. It's nice to have a nice clear strip at the end of the stream, you know what I mean? No one waiting, just nice and clean. So this is Air Portugal 1498. Let's get him lined up. Air Portugal 19820, runway 02, line up and wait. Runway zero two, line up and wait. Strip, so there you go. So he should be moving now. Yes, sir. But we'll stick with this one until he comes off. I'm assuming at Alpha Six again. in my airport text file. We didn't have any small airplanes, did we? Um, the last time we played this, we actually did have some small air airplanes. I, I made a little note saying, use Papa for small aircraft, but uh, we've not had to use Papa today, so that's that's quite nice. Right, well, this time to taxi to ramp, just to get him out of the way, to just, just to, you know, get complete closure on this guy before we do our final takeoff. Air Portugal 1498, taxi to ramp. Look at that, bro. Taxi no one at all to interfere with your taxi. Go any way you want. Air Portugal 19820, runway 02, clear for takeoff. Runway zero two, and this is it. For Final little bit of today's one hour stream. This is Air Portugal 1920 taking off on runway 02. Time coming up to 7 a.m. in game time. Yeah, we really must do another nighttime one soon. Hmm. I'll think about it. I'll think about it. I'm not promising for this week, but we'll see. We'll see. It's just, you can't see much at night, can you? <laughs> so I don't tend to do them that often. Anyway, here we go. Last plane. Air Portugal 1920, contact Lisbon departure on 118 decimal 905. Lisbon departure on 118.905, Air Portugal 1920. Good morning. Good morning. Well done. We'll watch you go into the distance, my friend. Lovely scenery. All right, guys. Uh, let's go back to the main menu. I imagine we've Probably not even done 20 planes today. Um, so let's have a little uh, look-see. <clears throat> oh, wow, we actually did do 20. <laughs> I love it when it just works out so nicely. Uh, so 20 planes in 60 minutes, that's basically one plane every three minutes, if my maths is correct, no mistakes, uh, which is which is good. Big thank you to my Patreon subscribers, Arius Lammer there at Gold. If you guys want to get behind the scenes, I always say this wrong, behind the scenes, sneak peeks. It's like a tongue twister uh, of my life, the things I get up to when I'm not streaming. Uh, check it out, patreon.com forward slash ATC Harry. There's a bronze, silver, gold, and platinum up for grabs, all with different bits and pieces. Uh, go check it out, it's worth, worth a look. Uh, if you're not into Patreon, that's fine too. Uh, we do have YouTube memberships. Click the uh, join button just underneath the stream there. And again, we've got a bronze, silver, gold, platinum. Uh, you can get a badge, you can get custom emojis. There's a whole ton of stuff. Check it out. Plus the bronze is like much, much cheaper than Twitch. It's like half the price of Twitch guys, level one. Um, so, you know, it's worth it. 
it's worth it. Um, also, you know, we've got to plug everything that we do here. If you want to leave a donation, click the link at the top of the chat. Donations support me and they support the stream. Um, and all donations are gratefully, gratefully received. Guys, we are done with today's extra special Tuesday stream. Just past the one hour mark as well. So that's amazing timing on my part. Uh, it's Wednesday tomorrow. We usually do do a stream on Wednesday. I'm not actually sure what I'm going to do yet at the point of recording this. Uh, so it's very much going to be a surprise for me as it is for you. Oh sevens in the chat, please. Thank you for an amazing, amazing stream. Have a good morning, afternoon or evening, wherever you are. And I will see you next time. Good night. <laughs>